Hello and welcome to this brief overview of the Strategic Account Management module for Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2013. The solution allows you to create an account plan per fiscal per client. You can set goals for each year, track the revenue performance as opportunities are created, and work to a defined process with checklist actions. You can also create business strategies and value propositions and link these to each plan. You can track relationship strengths with your key contacts, create contact plans and call pattern planning, and also track all the related activities, documents and emails to each account plan. There's also an account plan dashboard to help you visualize the information more easily. So let's go ahead and take a look at the strategic account management solution. Working in Dynamics CRM 2013 you can navigate to the account plan either directly from the account record or from the list view as shown here. Here we have a couple of account plans so let's navigate to one of these and take a closer look. OK, so here we have an account plan for a company called AdventureWorks and the first thing you'll notice at the top of the screen is a process bar. This is a very useful mechanism for ensuring that people stay on track working through the account plan systematically through the year. Typically at the start of the process you would be assessing the potential for that account. You may do some white space analysis and this is usually to establish the potential revenue from that account, the areas where you should be gaining more business, perhaps additional business divisions you should be working with or indeed just considering further product or service penetration into that account. You may want to set a specific target for that account and you can update that here using this target revenue field. As you work through the process you can see you can move on to the planning phase where you're, you're establishing the contacts you're, you should be working with, uh, establishing call and visit plans and then starting to engage with that account. As you move through the engagement process you'll be creating opportunities and making propositions and eventually you'll move on to the end of the process where you'll be reviewing uh, the performance of that account and you'll be able to see whether or not you've achieved any revenue with that uh, uh, account and indeed whether or not you've achieved the goal for that particular year. So the process bar is a very useful mechanism for keeping everything on track with the account plan throughout the year. OK, let's take a closer look at some other aspects of the account plan. It's important to set a start date and an end date for the account plan as this will help to drive automated calls and visits that get scheduled into the system. You can also store some basic text information and some key date information, for instance here looking at the next meeting. The system will also allow you to just store normal activities, notes and documents as you would with any other record in Microsoft CRM. The contact plans area allows you to create a specific call pattern or visit pattern with identified uh, individuals in that organization. So here we have a contact called Howard White. We know that the relationship is quite strong with that individual but we want to keep it strong and so the call frequency will be monthly and the visit frequency will be quarterly. Now in order to schedule those activities we can run an automated workflow that will uh, schedule each of those, both the visit and the calls, directly into the system and allocate them to the account manager so he or she is being automatically prompted to carry out that activity at the right time. This is a great time saver and a very efficient way of managing the contact plans associated with the account plan. The contact plans area is also a very useful source for providing a visual representation of the strength of relationship that you have with specific individuals in the key account. So here we can see we've got a pretty good relationship with Howard White but actually the relationship is not that strong with Tom Shanks. This ability to quickly visualize relationship strength will help guide you in your efforts as you try to grow your penetration into those accounts. Another dimension to the account plan is the ability to see a SWOT analysis showing the strengths, weaknesses, opportunities and threats related to this particular organization. If you're also trying to drive a particular business strategy through your own business and you're trying to particularly push it into your key accounts, you can associate those strategies and any related value propositions directly against the account plan. 
And finally, to bring all this information together, there's a convenient account plans dashboard. Here you can see the name of the account plan and the accounts that it relates to. You can keep track of all the activities that need to be carried out related to those accounts. And you can keep score on how your opportunities won are performing against the target that has been set for each particular organization. So this is a very useful way of looking at the account plans in a single console to help users better manage their key accounts. So just to summarize what we've been looking at, the Strategic Account Management module for Microsoft CRM 2013 allows you to see account plans per client per fiscal, track revenue performance against goals set for each of those accounts, work to a defined process with checklist actions, link business strategies and value propositions. Uh, we saw how you can track relationship strengths and view those in charts. You can run contact plans and establish call patterns throughout the year. You can also track all related activities, documents and emails. And the account plan dashboard brings all of the information together. So thank you for watching this brief overview. We hope you found it useful and if you'd like to know more about the strategic account management module or indeed any of our other add-on products please get in touch through the website.